made with unity. Paranormal Entities. You are Cliff. Okay. A college student who is a brand new freelance camera man for the show Paranormal Entities, the number two rated ghost investigation show on the hunting and outdoors cable network. You have been hired to inspect the St. Augustine Asylum for the Mentally Ill. You will go into this facility, follow the producer's instructions through a radio earpiece. Keep your camera on and try to make contact with the spirits inside. If nothing happens, you will get 500 for your time. If you manage to get some amazing footage of the real paranormal activity on your camera, blah, 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 not shown. Game Dev HQ. Let's start this. Let's start this. Oh. All right, Clint. Uh, what the Clint, Cliff, Cliff, what? Cliff, welcome to the St. Augustine's <clears throat> Asylum for the Mentally Ill. My producer Tom says oh, what, what, oh, what is with my, my chef? What's with the, what's with the arm? And EMF and a couple of little fun occult things. We'll let you know when to take those out. Is this, Ready to pay um, off some of those college debts and beer that one game, well, Phasmophobia, but are, uh, the free, ready, free version of it? In through those front doors. What the hell is that? Front doors, yes. All right, I have now entered the second the level of hell. All right. Oh, the holy bibble. Let me, let me, uh, let me, let me open that. Let me take a little peek. Eyeball, 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 eyeball. I learned that in health class. Everyone has an eyeball. I have no idea what that guy was talking about. Hmm? Give me a moment. I gotta check every door. Okay. Um. This is where the hundred hallways patients would convene. And we heard yes. that the patients pre-1920 actually <coughs> received decent care. Then really? the war hit, the depression hit. And I mean, the these look very apart. comfortable, man. The these chairs look, look awesome. I don't trust wheelchairs, and I quote that, I don't trust wheelchairs, I don't trust wheelchair people, like the most dangerous kind of people in the world, how many people see it though, oh, what do I do here, do I like, take a share right here, oh. nice blocky fingers, Yes. Reveal your presence to us. Show us that you Augustine. are in this room. Feel free show me. to interact with Sh show me. Or show me, Augustine. Use your Just words. Show me. Use your voice. Come on. Don't be, don't be shy. I know you want to show me. Come on. Come on. Okay. okay. Yeah, what, 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 what the fuck are the controls? What are the controls? Uh, nothing. All right. Let's try it again. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh. Oh. All right, all right. Let's try this. Ghosts of Saint Augustine. I can see Please those let us know that you are still in this hospital. I give you permission. Augustine. To yourself. Please I give you say something. To come to life. Come. Just give us a sign that you are to here. Life? Tell us. I think that where it's. I think, I'm pretty sure that's how Speak life is made. Now into this microphone. Yes, yell into the microphone. All right, check that. Now into this microphone. Try one more spot. Yeah, here we go. By the way, how the hell do you know that <sighs> I stopped at that spot? Augustine, you're all a bunch of ghoulish pricks. Show up or oh, piss off. Uh oh. You see, you didn't have to say oh, that, shit. my guy. Play that back. Play that back. You did pricks. not have to. Show up or piss off. Oh come on! This dude just put my life in danger. Oh, ho, 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 ho. You piece all of right, poop! All right, we, looks like we got an investigation. All right, I want you to go down the morgue hallway, and we're gonna continue our investigation in the other gathering area. All right. Where is this hallway, by the way? This dude really just kind of fucking do that. That dude just put my whole life in danger. He's not even here. He's on the other okay, side. If I die, oh man, I'm gonna lose my mind. The east social area is the first on the list. Hmm. This is the area where what? the inmates 
society would convene. What? You'll go to this room and perform what the? a summoning ceremony. So walk into the center what, and what, we will what, begin. What? What? What the? F why is that necessary? Is Mr. Slenderman in here? Well, not like a Slenderman Asylum game or something. Batman Arkham Asylum. There we go. That's the game. Yes, maybe. No, I don't know. Surgery. Take me. Okay. Uh huh. It's a whole lot of surgery. Hmm. Patient rooms. Nope. Keep going the wrong way. Was it this door? Maybe it was this door. This is the entrance to patient cell 2219. We're talking extreme bipolarism, schizophrenia, oh. dementia. Not necessarily dangerous, but it could be a challenge for society. Oh, uh, dangerous, Doors maybe. Locked. Probably not. Unless, you know, they're demonic uh, spirits. Which, definitely dangerous. I don't think I should be in here after that incident. Where the hell do I go? This is the entrance to the patient cells 220 to 240. This is where they kept the lunatics, <clears throat> the murderers, the sociopaths, the worst of the God, worst. They really are obsessed with their eyes. Peeper Johnson. You'd think you'd Peeper Johnson? With a nickname, the Peeper. What the? But the truth is far worse. Was he was extremely manipulative and very intelligent. He was a murderer and a memer. Most of his victims could never identify him because a he memer? managed to convince them. Their own eyes I thought I heard something wires, behind me. And even their own fingernails. He came here to the legal loopholes. And What's up, guys? My name is Johnson. I'm a memer. He jumped into action. And then that's how he ended up here, I think. Didn't listen, were tortured, and the ones who did wandered around the facility, blind, screaming, and in constant fear. The door's locked too. Hmm. Let's just start the ceremony. All right. What door? I would really. Oh, oh! I've just been. Okay. Well, shit. Spirits inside what this the asylum. fuck? Wait. We know that you're here. We what? release you from your restraints. Yo. Come forward and live the, again. The, the, no, 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 no. This person is no longer shielded from the realm of the dead. You may be seen, what? interact, and manipulate huh? him in any what, way. What the hell is she doing? Dude, this guy is just. This guy's setting me up for death. What? What kind of. What kind of guy is this? Huh? Do do, do quick 180s. Quick 180s. Quick 180s. Check it out. Quick one. Oh, it's open. Hey, where you at? I know you're gonna pop out in the middle of this hallway. Or you're gonna grab me from the side doors. Hey, I saw that. Do a do a flip. Am I in a loop? I. S Am I stuck here? What happened? I see people just m duplicating in there. Game. Oh, shit. Oh, it was one lady. I don't know what happened. I honestly have no idea what the hell just happened. Ma'am. Ma'am, you're very beautiful. Uh, I'd like to be your boyfriend. You, you, you were actually very, very pretty. But then you did like a joker smile, and then that's when I was like, oof, you, you are the one. No die eyes. Run, no, don't. See, I am out. Death run no eyes. I honestly don't don't know what you're trying to get at. Okay, front door. So this is where I die. This is an awesome haunted house, by the way. I forgot to mention this game takes place in a right, haunted get out house. Of hallway and then take a take your second right. Uh, second second right. This one. Okay, I was right. Take the staircase up the second floor, and you and should be jump next off the roof. A fire escape. You should be able to get out that way. So, so go up the staircase. Go up the staircase. Wow, what an 
What a random staircase to just be right here. My battery hasn't been going down this whole time, by the way. It's locked. It's locked. If I just... Ish locked. Lady, you down here? Uh, okay, we need to... Let's go get something to pry this door open. Go back downstairs. I, I bet you there was something downstairs we could probably use. Uh-huh, yep. I, uh, you bet. You oh, would not know. On. That staircase wasn't there before. This place doesn't even have a basement. What the... What, what is going you on? You are right. It right. keeps right. going down. I don't think you got any other choice. I think you gotta make your way downstairs. <laughs> God damn. Oh, that's why. Okay, whoops. Okay, I'm gonna just do boom. That's how I'm gonna start turning. Because this game is borderless and it keeps going on my second monitor. That's, that's, that's why. So let's say, whoop. Yeah, 180s. Um. I, I, oh, oh. What the heck? What the heck is that? Yeah, you forgot to light a candle, ma'am. Oh. Alright, let's open this. Poor cow. Like, I can't do anything about it. I can't help him. Get my little, little Among Us guy just staring at me in the corner. Got a little, little plushie. Looks cool. Really appreciate my brother getting me that for my birthday. Um... Okay, we're going back. Don't stop, can't stop, won't stop, but I don't know what I'm seeing. Hey, hey, we could go back, and it's completely different. Hmm. I, I, I always go right. Right is always the right way. Looks like we're going left. Can I run? I feel like there's a running button in, in this game this whole entire time, but I just don't know it. Whoa! Okay, alright. That one got me. I gotta be honest, that one got me. Alright, can I, can, I, can I please get the fuck out of here? Please, this game is scaring the shit out of me at this point. Come on, just, just a little bit more. Am I right? Am I right? Hmm? I'm right. This is the exit. All right. All right. <laughs> oh shit. I go right here. I go right here. I go right here. Right here. Right here. Oh, what do y'all want me to do? What? Oh shit. And then jump scare. Water. Ooh, drinking water this time up. This one open now. Okay, what is going on here? Oh, it's blood. Oh, okay. Alright, this alright, that one got me too. I got it. This game's actually pretty fucking scary. Oh hell no. Oh, these guys did a pretty good job on this game. I gotta Wow, this is incredible. I saw the blood. I I, I knew there was going to be something right, on that ceiling. Time. Uh, it's about the eyes. I kind of had this from you. What the There's fuck? an urban legend, and, and I, I repeat, it's an urban legend about the this people who climbed Johnson. This pair of eyes. There was a patient who suffered from dementia and swore that Clive was more than just a mere man, and uh, he would kind of haunt this patient. I, I mean, look at that. He's just peeling his skin off. Got worse, but at night, he never saw the peeper. Then he discovered Look at this dude dancing. He's doing a little, little, little jig. But whenever he opened them, Clive would be there, waiting for him and getting closer and closer. Eventually, yes, I agree. He used a fork and he blinded himself. And while he was soaked in his blood from his sockets, he screamed to the entire mm. hospital that he was free. He was safe. <laughs> Later, Ouch. two more patients charged Clive with stalking them, even though he was confined to solitary. I mean, it's crazy. They, they took their eyesights, too. His pattern didn't stop. Well, I took I his fucking eyes. Yes, but based on what we've seen tonight, I don't 
pretty much believe anything. So, try to get the hell out of there, and if it gets too intense, try to shut your eyes. What? What do you mean, shut my eyes? Is that an option? Oh, this is like that, that, um... Damn flashlight broke. I can't use that anymore. What? Hello? There's someone? Well, looks like we're going back. Got no other way. Oh. Yeah. What do you mean, run? That dude is a giant. Damn. Yeah, okay. Let's fit through here. I, I seem to just uh, be running in circles at... What the... All right, I'm running. I'm just gonna spectate the... What? I'm trying. This dude just likes to walk, though. All right, here we go. Gonna keep on going and not look back. What if I, you know, just look back? Kind of want to look back. I'm looking back. <clears throat> oh, look at that. It's the Holy Bibble. Can I read that? Oh. Oh, hell no. I'm, I'm literally stuck here. Either he gets you, or you're, you're gonna have to cut him out. I can't, I cannot. <laughs> what? Did I just Holy come? Holy crap, man. I can't believe you just did that. You freaking gouged your eyes out with a scalpel. Are you alright? No. I know you're not, huh? All right, all right, we're, we're, we're getting a picture from your camera. Bad news is it's pitch black. There, there's no light. Your room, there's nothing I could see. The flashlight went out. Oh we, my god. I'm not going in there. I, I, do you, are you going in there? I'm not going in there. What? Uh, hell no. What do you... Uh, I just... Uh, my, uh, I just pretty much killed myself. I'm, Oh, sorry. Oh my god. We're not coming. I'm sorry, man. I have to go. Jesus Christ. Sorry. What? Oh, god damn it. That was an incredible game. Thank you for playing. Please leave a review on the page. Let me know your thoughts about the game. My name is Al Heck, and I. Made this game in 10 days for the Scream Jam 2020 event. My friend John and I founded GameDevHQ.com. We believe game development is an amazing skill and a great tool to tell stories. If you ever wanted to learn how to build a video game, we'd, we would love to show you how. This entire game was built using GameDevHQ training and its library of high quality assets and the you need to have blah 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 it. Wow. That was incredible. I must say that was a very fun, that was a fun, scary horror game. Hate, the, hate my goddamn friend. He did absolutely nothing, but that's fine. That's part of it. Oh. Thank you, Game Dev HQ. Very cool. Anyways, guys, as always, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my shit, turn on notifications. And as always, please subscribe. Really appreciate it a lot. And yeah. Goodbye.